hands, he wants to make shapes with Play-Doh. Me! Let's use these shape cutters. Wow, they're sea animals! What's this animal? <laughs> it's a crab! Yeah! Which color dough do we need? Red! Roll out the dough with the rolling pin! Roll it out large and flat. Then press in the crab cutter. Push it down and pull it out. Now we can peel away the dough. Wow, look! We've got a crab! Not yet, JJ. We've got to decorate it first. Finally, crab's eyes. And a mouth, too. Did you know that crabs can walk in all directions, but mainly walk and run sideways? Wow, that's amazing! He wants to pick the next sea animal. Me! I choose this one! What animal is it? Yeah, a shark! Yeah! Let's use the pink dough! Use the rolling pin to roll, roll, roll it out! Oh, nice and round! Now we're ready to press in the cutter! Yeah, press it really hard! Peel away the dough! Look, we've got a shark! What's that piece? It's shark's belly! Oh, shark's got sharp teeth! Did you know that sharks have awesome eyesight? At night, they can see even better than a cat! That's amazing! Hi, hi! <laughs> My turn! I want to make a big sea animal with lots of legs! Octopus! Which color, JJ? Okay, I choose blue dough! We need to roll a lot for this big octopus! It's ready! Let's press in the shape! Now we'll carefully peel the dough away! Hurrah! Here comes the eyes! Now Octopus can see us too! <laughs> Let's decorate with lots of blue and pink dots! Yippee! It looks so cute and cool! Now it's a happy octopus! Did you know that octopus build their homes using rocks? They even make a door to close when they're at home! Isn't that amazing? They're octopus builders! <laughs> Do you know which sea animal is my favorite? No? Tell us! And I'm going to use the color green. Roll the dough up and down until it's big and flat. Let's put it in the cutter and press it down. I can see my turtle now. Put on its brown shell. And add some green dots. Next comes the eye. And a big smile too. 
Did you know that some sea turtles can hold their breath underwater for up to five hours? Wow, they are so amazing! Let's try the big yellow star shape next. What do you think it is? That's right! A starfish! Which color dough? Yellow! Roll the dough wide and long! To make it thin and flat! Now we can press in the shape! We're ready to peel it out! Then decorate with blue and pink dots! Up to the eyes, a smiley mouth! Yay! It's done! Did you know that starfish can swim? Instead, they walk or crawl over seaweed and rocks. I'm learning to swim. How about you? I can't swim yet, but I'm going to learn soon. Can I pick the next cutter? Of course! I pick this one! Yeah! Another shark! Which color dough, JJ? Blue! Rolling pin ready! And roll, roll, roll we go! Spread the dough out wide! We need it longer! Keep rolling! It's ready! Hurrah! Press and push down hard. Then pull it off. Yippee! Here comes the belly. Next, two big eyes. Get ready for shark's mouth and sharp teeth. Wow! Shark-tastic! Did you know sharks are one of the oldest animals on Earth? They were alive when dinosaurs were. That's why they needed big sharp teeth. <laughs> <laughs> what sea animal is the purple cutter? Do you know? Yes, it's a seahorse. Which color is dull this time? Purple. Let's roll the dough big enough for our cutter. Whew, it's getting long. It's ready for our seahorse shape. Pull out the cutter and peel off the dough. Seahorse can have a pink belly. This is so much fun! Don't forget Seahorse's eye! Oops! Here it is! Did you know many seahorses can change color so that they can hide from bigger fish? So don't play hide and seek with a seahorse! <laughs> <laughs> now my turn to make my favorite sea animal! Fish! And I choose orange dough! It's a big fish, so we need to roll the dough big and flat! Do you think it's big enough? It is if we turn it around. Let's check. Perfect. Now let's press it down and give it a wiggle. Pull the dough away. Yeah, decorating time. Which fish am I making? Yeah, Nemo. Nemo is a clownfish. And did you know that they can talk? They make popping and clicking noises to other clownfish. 
Do you think they talk as much as JJ? <laughs> Come on, everyone. Get ready for an adventure under the sea with our friends. Wow, awesome! Under the sea playtime for you and me. Hooray! Hello, everyone. Today we're playing with our Paw Patrol friends. Each tub has colorful Play-Doh in it. Where should we start? This one? Good choice. And the Play-Doh is dark blue. Let's roll it out. It's nice and flat. We have this special cutter. Let's press it into the Play-Doh. This is so exciting. We need to peel off the extra Play-Doh. Then remove the cutter. Let's see what it looks like. Wow, look at this, friends. We may chase. Do you know what his job is? Yes! Yes, he's a police dog. Let's open this pot next. What color do you think it is? That's right, it's pink. Now we'll roll it out like a pizza. Mmm, I like pizza. We'll press our pink cutter into the Play-Doh. Just like this. And carefully lift the cutter. It's Sky. Woof, woof. Let's put her next to Chase. We've got a lot more to open. Do you know what color this is? It's yellow. Well done. It's so soft and squishy. We need to make it nice and flat. This is our next cutter. Who do you think it is? Let's find out. I need to peel it off the table. You were right, it's Rubble! Rubble goes next to the yellow pot. I think I know what color this is. Shout out nice and loud if you know. It's red! Well done, friends. Can you think of something that's red? You got it! Strawberries are red. Let's push the cutter into the Play-Doh. I know who this is. Shall we take a look? I knew it. It's Marshall. He drives a red fire truck. You're doing great, friends. The next color is purple. Let's squash it. <laughs> it feels funny. We have a purple cutter. I wonder who this will be. Let's see. It's Everest. Yeah! Everest is a husky. She climbs up high mountains. But today, she's having fun with her friends. Let's open another pot. This looks interesting. This color is called turquoise. Can you say turquoise? Well done. Hmm? We need a cutter. That's better. We'll press it into our Play-Doh. Let's find out who this will be. Shout out if you know. Yay, it's Rocky. Can you see his turquoise clothes? Yes. We'll put Rocky over here. This is the next pot. What color is inside? It's orange. Yeah! That felt good. We need to make one of the Paw Patrol crew. Do you know who this is? Mm -hmm. Shout out if you do. That's a good guess. Let's find out if you're right. You got it. It's Zuma. Zuma helps the animals. He must be a good swimmer. This is the last pot. It's blue. Let's use the roller. The blue cutter goes on the blue play dough. We need to press it down. We can use the extra play dough later. Now we'll carefully remove the cutter. Look at this. It's Ryder. He's the leader of the Paw Patrol. We've got them all, yay! Look at all the colors. 
It's like a Paw Patrol rainbow. Let's draw a triangle. And we'll use Rubble's color. This pen is yellow. I need to draw three yellow lines. That makes a triangle. Now we need to paint it. Rubble has yellow paint. We can use this to color the triangle. Do you know how many sides the triangle has? Let's count them together. One, two, three. The triangle has three sides. We finished painting the triangle. And we found Rubble. Look at his yellow hat. Do you know what color this is? That's right, it's pink. I know what to draw with this. We can draw a heart. It looks so pretty. We need a paintbrush. Let's paint the heart. We'll fill it with this pink paint. Painting is so much fun. What do you like to paint? Wow, that sounds great. Our heart is finished. And we've got a Paw Patrol pup. It's Sky. Wow. Look at her cool jetpack. Zoom, zoom. She's flying through the air. Let's see. What shape is next? It's gonna be round. We'll use a blue pen for this. It's a circle. We'll paint the inside blue. Let's think of blue things. The sky, the sea. Good job, friends. Our circle is blue. We've got another Paw Patrol member. It's Chase. He's got a hook to grab things. Can you see his wagging tail? And we'll use this paint for our next shape. Do you know what this color is called? It's red. The next shape has four sides. It's a square. We'll paint the square now. I think red is my favorite color. What's your favorite color? Oh, I like that one too. The square is ready. We found Marshall. Can you see his fire hose? Wow. He's here to save the day. Let's put him over here. What color is this? That's right, it's green. We'll use the green pen to draw the next shape. Ah, I know. The shape has five points. It's a star. The star is going to be green. Stars are in the night sky. I know a song about stars. Will you sing it with me? Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Wow, you're great at singing. Our green star means we get another toy. It's Rocky. Whoa, did you see that? We'll put him next to Rubble. The next pen is orange. This shape has a funny name. It's a rhombus. We'll use the orange paint for this. Orange is the name of a color and a fruit. I like oranges. Mmm, yummy. We finished the rhombus. What toy will we get? It's Zuma. That's the last toy. We've got all of the Paw Patrol. I've had the best time, friends. Thanks for all your help. I'll see you next time. Bye. Hi, friends. Come and join me in making ice cream Play-Doh today. Can you help me to choose the right colors? Our ice cream store is ready. Who is our first customer? Hmm. It's Tom Tom. Let's say hello. Hello, Tom Tom. What flavor ice cream would you like? 
I'd like a strawberry ice cream, please. Okay, can you wait over there? What color is strawberry? Red! Yes, strawberries are red. Let's use this mold. In goes the red dough. Press it into the shape. Then close and squeeze it together. Put in a stick and press the mold. Wow! A super strawberry ice cream! Tom Tom, come over! Your ice cream's ready! Yeah, but something's missing! Would you like some candy topping? Oh yes, some sparkly stars would be great! Can you see the star-shaped candy? This one? Are these star-shaped? Okay, what about these? Yes, let's sprinkle them onto the ice cream. Great! Let's see if Tom Tom likes it. Hurrah! Strawberry and sparkles! It tastes so scrummy and yummy! Hi, can I have an ice cream too? Hi, Bella. What flavor would you like? Hmm, I like grapes. Can I have grape flavor, please? You stand and wait, Bella, whilst we make it for you. What color do we need? Purple. Purple grapes are my favorite. Here's our mold. Let's put in the dough. Press it shut. Press it hard. Let's pull off this part. Now for the stick. Push it in as far as it will go. Wow! Grape-tastic! Hey, Bella, come and see your ice cream. I'm coming. Wow, it's so purple and juicy. Could I have some snowflake candy topping too, please? Okay. Help me find the snowflakes. Are these snowflakes? No. What about these? No, they're not snowflakes. Yes, here are the sparkling snowflakes. This'll be done in snow time. Ha ha. Frosty frosting. Ha ha. Wow, it looks like a purple igloo. Delicious. Thanks, guys. You're the best. Hi, Cody. Hi, everyone. So, Cody, which flavor ice cream would you like? Oh, do you have pineapple flavor? Yes, I do. Stand over there and wait. Which color for pineapple? Yellow. Thanks, kids. Let's grab our mold and put in the yellow dough. Now close and squeeze. Let's take off the squishy sides. What do we need next? That's right, push in the stick. Oops, wrong end. And let's open it up. Cody? Wow, so cool! But I'd really like some sprinkles on it. Which ones? Hmm, I want some red love hearts, please. Okay, I'll find some. Hoorah! Let's find the love heart candy. Are these love hearts? These are red. Are they heart shaped? Yes, let's layer it with love. Wow, it's looking good. Do you think Cody will like it? cream looks the best. Let me try it. Tastes like pineapple love. Ha <laughs> ha. Hello everyone. Hello Nina. What would you like? I'd like an apple flavor ice cream, please. Wait over there. Which color apple? Green. Let's use this mold with a pattern on it. 
Push and spread the dough around. Close it and press down hard. Now we'll peel off the extra dough. And it's ready for the stick. Wow, look, Nina! Yippee! My ice cream's shaped like a beautiful butterfly. Would you like it decorated? Yes, please. Can I have candy circles on it? Coming right up! Can you find the circle candies? Thanks, friends. Let's sprinkle them on. Nina, it's ready. I'd better take a lick before it flies away. Ha ha! Awesome, guys! This is the best butterfly ice cream ever. Hi, everyone. Hello, Nico. Which ice cream would you like? Can I have two flavors? Pineapple and grape, please? Okay, you wait whilst I mix them up. We need purple and yellow together for this ice cream. Yellow dough on top and purple below. Then we'll close it up and squish squash together. Wow, Nico, come and see! It's awesome! Can I have topping too? Which topping? Oh, I think flowers would look so cool! What do you think? Where are the flowers? What about these? You think these? Yes, you found them! Let's sprinkle them on. It's a flower forest! It's ready, Nico! Wow, I can't wait to try it! It tastes as yummy as it looks. Thanks, guys. Look, kids, JJ is here. Hello, JJ. Do you want an ice cream? Oh, yes. I'd like a blueberry ice cream, please. I'll get that for you. You wait over there. Which color do we need? Blue! Let's put blue into the mold and press it down. Squeeze it together. Do you think it's ready? Not yet. What do we need to push in next? Yes, we need a stick! Let's open it up. Wow! JJ, come and check it out! Wow! I can smell the blueberry flavor! Mmm! What about a candy topping? Yes! Do you have seashell candies? Let me go and check. Take a look, guys! Can you see seashells? What shape are these? Seashells, yes! Let's shake on the shells. Wow! Hurrah! It looks like the ocean! And it tastes delicious. <laughs> Hello, Yo-Yo! Have you come for an ice cream, too? Yes! Bubblegum flavor is my favorite! Can I have one of those? Yes, we'll make one for you. Wait over there. What color? Pink. Let's make Yo-Yo an ice cream with this mold. Press in the dough nice and tight. Squeeze it together and pull off the extra dough. Ready, let's open it up. What animal is it? shaped ice cream. Hurrah! Which candy topping do you want? Hmm. I'd like two toppings, red love hearts, and sparkly stars. Uh, is that okay? Of course. Okay, friends. Can you help me find the two toppings, please? 
Love hearts first. Sprinkle, sprinkle. And here are the shining stars. Let's check out Yo-Yo's rabbit. It's ready, Yo-Yo. Run, rabbit, run. Straight to me. Uh, thanks, guys. It's so yummy. We've sold all our ice cream today. Thanks for helping. Bye, friends. Hello, friends. Look at our colorful Play-Doh. Are you ready? What colors do we have? Hmm. Pink? White? Purple? Green? Orange? Black? Yellow? Hmm, what should we make? Ah! Let's hunt for some cutters. Let's see what's inside here. Oh! What is it? It's a fox! Yay! What color is the fox cutter? Can you help me? Is it pink? White? Purple? Green? Orange? Yay! Yes! We need orange. Thanks, guys. We want our rolling pin now. Let's roll. Roll. Roll the dough. Ha ha. It's ready to push in the cutter. Press it down. And lift it up. Now his feet. His bushy tail. Two ears. Hmm, what's next? Yes. His nose and whiskers. Don't forget his two eyes. Foxes are only a little bit bigger than cats. But they are a member of the dog family. Okay, let's search through this bowl and find our next animal shape. What's this animal? Yes, it's a giraffe. <laughs> Which color do we need? Pink? White? Purple? Green? Orange? Black? Yellow? Yay! Well done! That's right. We need yellow dough for giraffe. We need to roll a long piece for the giraffe. Just right. Let's push down the cutter. Now, we have our shape. We'll peel off the dough. Time to decorate. First the eye. A brown tail. And lots of spots. Giraffes are the tallest mammals in the world. Even a newborn baby giraffe is taller than most humans. Let's see what animal's inside the pink balls. Here it is. It's a butterfly. What color is this cutter? Do you think it's black? No. Green? Purple? Yes, you got it! Yay! Hurrah! Get ready to roll. Push out, roll back. Up and down we go. Press it down and give it a wiggle. Peel the dough for our butterfly shape. We'll give it a blue body. And we'll decorate all the wings so that they look the same, just like real butterflies some blue feelers on top of its head. And then two eyes. Let's flutter and watch the video. Butterflies have six legs and they use them to walk and climb. Just like us.
Here come the green balls. Get ready to hunt. Can you see it? What is it? That's right, it's a frog. Tell me, which color do we need? Pink? Black? Green? You got it right! Come on, let's start rolling. How do we roll? Push out, roll back, up and down we go. Yeah! Wow, this is a big frog cutter, isn't it? We can see the frog shape now, can't we? Frog has two big eyes. A red mouth. Let's meet Frog's friends. Frogs live in or around water and even a puddle can be their home. Did you know? Frogs close their eyes when they eat. Wow! Now we've got a mix of brown and white balls to look through. Look! It's a zebra! Hmm, which color this time? Black? Pink? White? Yes, we'll use white for the zebra's body. Is it big enough? Yes, perfect! Wow, look at our shape! It looks like a horse, doesn't it? That's because zebras are a type of wild horse. Let's put lots of black stripes onto it. Zebras live in families just like we do. They use their black stripes to hide from big hungry animals like lions. What animal cutter will be hiding in the white balls? Found it! It's got a long nose! It's a big gray elephant. Oh no! What will we do? We don't have any gray dough? But if we take black and white and do a magic mix. We've got gray, yeah! Now we can make our elephant. Lots of rolling for this big elephant shape. Press down the cutter and pull it off. Its long nose is called a trunk. And they use it like we use our fingers. We need a big ear for our elephant. Let's watch some real elephants. Elephants love water. They drink, swim, and play in rivers. Don't forget to put on your trunks. Haha! <laughs> Here's our last bowl to look through. What do you think our last animal will be? Aha! It's a bear. Did you guess right? Which color this time? Pink? Yes! Our bear's gonna be pretty in pink! Rolling time! Bears are big, strong, and fast animals. They are good at climbing, swimming, and running. Let's peel off the dough and decorate our bear. We need two eyes. A black nose. And our bear's gonna have a love heart. Haha! -ha. What do you call a bear with no teeth? A gummy bear! Haha! -ha. Polar bears are the largest bears that live in the cold Arctic. Look, our bowl's empty. We finished all our animals for the zoo park. Hey! Let's take a look around the animal park. Here's our orange fox and his friend has come along too. 
Yellow giraffe has joined his family. They can see very far with their long necks. Look, frog is hiding behind the bushes. Many frogs can change their skin color to hide from bigger animals. Here's butterfly. He's going to fly to the flowers with his friends. Butterflies eat the nectar inside flowers. Yum! Our zebra now has a new family to live with. Elephant's going to eat some plants with his new friends. Pink bear has joined the polar bear, brown bear, and panda. Hope you had fun playing with our new friends today. Bye! Hello, friends. Today, we'll be learning all about numbers and colors. Let's start with this tub and the number one. Do you know what color it is? That's right, it's pink. Let's open it. It's going to be so much fun. Ooh, it's so soft and squishy. Let's flatten it. That's much better. This is the number one. We'll press it into the Play-Doh. Now, I can remove the extra Play-Doh. Look at this, friends. It's a pink number one. One. One pink squishy octopus. The next color is green. Can you think of anything that's green? Grass, leaves, and frogs. Well done. Wow. You know a lot of green things. I'm impressed. My favorite is the frog. Let's roll the green Play-Doh out. It's like making a pizza. I've never had a green pizza before. Next, we'll press the number two into it. Then peel off the Play-Doh. This feels so funny. Now we have a green number two. Let's take it out of the mold. The number two. Look, one ball, two balls. Let's open more Play-Doh. It's yellow and the number three. I like this color. It's so bright. Let's press this Play-Doh. Phew, that was hard work. Let's think of something yellow that you can eat. A banana, right. Next, we have the number three. I'll press it into the Play-Doh. That should do it. Then we'll remove the extra Play-Doh. Wow, look at this. Oops, it's falling out. The number three. I've got one egg, two eggs, three eggs. Wow! This color is called purple. This is the fourth tub of Play-Doh. Come on, we'll open it. It's such a nice color. I thought of something purple. It's a fruit. Can you guess? You got it. It was a grape. The Play-Doh is nice and flat. We can press the shape into it. This will help us make our next number. Do you know what it is? Let's find out. Well done. It's the number four. Let's count these balls. One ball, two balls, three balls, four balls. Wow. We still have more Play-Doh to open. Let's try this one. It's blue. I think blue is my favorite color. Hmm, what's blue? The sky, the sea, yes. Wow, that was great. We'll need to roll this Play-Doh out. We can use my super roller. Let's press the shape into it. I don't want to make any mistakes. I'll be careful peeling the extra Play-Doh. We've got another number, friends. Shout it out loud. Whoa, that was really loud. It's the number five. I have five carrots that are ready to be planted. Can you help me? One orange carrot, two orange carrots, three orange carrots, Four orange carrots. Five orange carrots. Look, it's purple again. 
Can you say purple? Purple! That was great! Let's make a purple circle. Then we can flatten it out. Hmm, I'll need my roller. This helps it get really thin. I'll flip it over and roll it again. It's like a purple pancake. We've got the next number right here. Let's push it into the Play-Doh. That's perfect. We can play with this extra Play-Doh later. Here it is, friends. The number six. Say it out loud. Well done. Six. One bucket. Two buckets. Three buckets. Four buckets. Five buckets. Six buckets. They're so colorful. Whoa, where did this come from? It's number seven. And this color is turquoise. Can you say turquoise? It's a hard word, but you did great. I'm proud of you. Now we can roll the turquoise Play-Doh out. It's ready for the next number. I'll push it into the Play-Doh now. It will give us a turquoise number. Do you know what number it is? Great job, friends! It's number seven. Wow, we've got seven buzzing bees. Let's put them into the hive. One bee, two bees, buzz, buzz. Three bees, four bees, five bees, six bees, seven bees. This color is yellow. A yellow ball of Play-Doh. Let's put the shape into it. I'll push it into the middle. Then we can remove this part. Yay! We've got our next number. The number eight. There are eight tasty popsicles. One tasty popsicle. Two tasty popsicles. Three tasty popsicles. Four tasty popsicles. Five tasty popsicles. Six tasty popsicles. Seven tasty popsicles. Eight tasty popsicles. This Play-Doh is pink. Let's take it out of the tub. I'll press and squash it. Hmm, let's use the roller. Can you think of an animal that's pink? A pig, yes, that's right. Oink, oink. Let's press the shape into the Play-Doh. I wonder what number it'll be. Do you know? You got it, it's the number nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine. Nine cute animals. This color is blue. Let's open the blue Play-Doh. We need to flatten it. Then we can press the shapes into it. This number has two shapes. It's the number 10. One frog. Two frogs. Three frogs. Four frogs. Five frogs, six frogs, seven frogs, eight frogs, nine frogs, ten frogs. Yay! The colors are like a rainbow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well done, friends. I'll see you next time.